Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? I'm back with some Pokemon Silver. Uh, Nuzlocken. Into, we're gonna go fight the gym leader now. Isn't it exciting? Our current team is of course Kit Fisto at level 7, Mouse at level 6, and Nux at level 9. Uh, I don't know what level I should be to fight you, gym leader, but I should be perfectly fine. I'm hoping at during this battle, um, Kit Fisto will learn Rock Throw, and if he does, he's basically won this. Hello, Abe. Ah, oh, Spiro. Level 9! Holy shit! Ooh. I'm gonna quickly defense. Okay. So, <laughs> level 9 is more than I was expecting, to be honest. Um, but it should be fine, because we have Kit Fisto. Ah, uh, even with a crit, that wasn't that bad. But you need to actually hit the damn target. Okay, this is actually not going great. Because if Kit Fisto goes down, ain't nothing protecting the other two. I mean, Nux will probably be able to take down Sparrow perfectly fine, but... Mouse is way too low, low level to actually fight anything here. Okay, we crit back, we crit back. Okay. You got this, Kit Fisto. You were born for this. You were captured for this specific moment right here that you're about to have. Alright, not bad. Still not good that you almost uh, at half health fighting a Spiro, but hey, it is two levels on you. You got this, Kit Fisto, you got this. Good, 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 good. 111, baby. Grew up to level 8. He's so close to level 9. Really? You did not learn? This can't be true. Believe it. Remember the name. Or we're gonna go back. Heal up Geodude real quick, and then hope that the next guy is not level 9, because if so, I'm not going back in there to fight Faulkner until some people gain some levels. Alright, let's say thank you for waiting. Pokemon fully healed up. Later. Alright, let's go fight. Fight, fight, fight. Fight, fight, fight. Fighting Faulkner. Fighting Faulkner. But first is underground lackeys. The key word is Guts. Oh, Guts is in this game? Hello, Gutsu. What's going on here? I should mention, if you like these videos, you should leave a like now that I'm two minutes in. <laughs> it really helps me out, and I really like seeing the likes. Level 7, man. These dudes ain't fooling, they ain't joshing around at all. But thankfully, Kit Fisto is a, is a, he's a machine, so there's no way for him to be taken down by anything. At least, least of all a bird. Okay, not bad. Ooh. Kit Fisto's gonna take it down. Boom. I'm almost positive that Geodude might actually learn Rock Throw at level 10, which in which case, mm, that's not the greatest definitely be better. One down. 82. We're about to learn right now. Damn it. Alright. Another Pidgey, huh? I'm gonna use the defense curl. Oh, he was already only doing one damage. <laughs> and crit ignores the fence anyway. So, let's go back to tackling. I think I'm gonna switch in Nux. I would switch in Mouse, but I think for the time and purpose, I think having Nux strong would be better. Yeah, Nux is definitely taking a backseat in terms of leveling. I'm gonna do one more just because I don't trust. I don't trust anything. Okay, okay. Alright, Nux. Just don't take a crit and you'll be fine. You got this, Nux. Let's see how much damage he does regularly. Mmm, it's more than I would like, to be honest. Alright, Pidgey's down. Hmm. Hmm. I'm right at Faulkner, but I just don't... I don't know what to trust, to be honest. Hmm. I'm gonna go heal, though. 
Let me go down there. Go here. Go up there. And then heal me up, baby. No, I was pressing the wrong button. healed up. Everything's fine. Let me see, does Kipfisto have his... There we go. Oh, come on, are you kidding me for the love of Lord? There we go. He doesn't have a berry, so we should give him a berry. Berry? Alright. Go down here. Go up here. And I guess we'll fight Faulkner. I don't know. Hmm, let me think about this. Try and figure out, like, so... Worst case scenario, I literally... This is where I die. Nothing good happens. I'm thinking that his Pokémon might be level 11, which is what's scaring me. But ah, uh, screw it. Geodude's been so good. You know, I'm pretty sure whatever he's got, I'm just gonna go crazy with the, um, the defense curl and hope that none of the moves he has can get past it. But hey, let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. Famous last words. And hope to the Lord that he doesn't know... What DM do you even get from here? Oh shit. I just remembered what you get from here. It's Mud Slap, isn't it? Oh, son of a bitch. Oh, God. This suddenly makes everything ten times worse. No! I mean, it's not super effective, but he's also not gonna get... Oh, this is so bad. Mouse is the only one that can fight. I forgot that fucking Mud Slap. And Mud Slap is special attack, isn't it? Fucking special attack. Cause this isn't- I'm not taking any less damage from this. I'm not taking any less damage from this. Oh god. I'm fucked. There's nothing I can do. Alright. I'm gonna start fighting back now. I think I've- My plan of defense curling to victory is not gonna win. But thankfully Pidgey has low special attack, right? But I can't hit him for shit. Oh, god damn it. This is all lost, isn't it? It's too late. This is over. He can't, literally, he can't hit him for anything. Oh, Jesus Christ. How many potions do I even have? It's not gonna deal enough damage. It deals a lot of damage. But he has so many more mud slaps in him. It deals three at a time. I don't know, man. I just don't know. And he crit me, too? Oh, there's no way for me to get any lower. Do I not have any potions, either? No, I was about to say I totally have potions. <sighs> okay. Let's, let's think this through. As my poor Pokemon gets covered in mud and is unable to fight... Oh, but is he out? I think he's out. Because otherwise he would just use it again, right? Okay. Okay. So here's the new plan. <laughs> Kit Fisto 100% um, survives it all. Because if Kit Fisto goes down, this is all bad. I have to say, I have to change the mouse. I think I have to change the mouse. There's like nothing I can do. I'm afraid of taking any damage with Kit Fisto right now. Special defense is 14. Will this Pidgeotto deal 21 hits of damage to Kit Fisto? Let's find out. 
Okay, he's not. <laughs> he's not. Okay. So we've just entered a war of attrition because now we know for sure Mudslap is limited. So... Oh my god, Kid Fisto. Okay, after this Mudslap, I'm gonna heal. No, I think he can take another damage, I think. Okay. Okay, Kid Fisto, I need you to not get crit here. Okay. You've done good. You've done extraordinarily. Extraordinarily? No, you've done amazing. There you go. And you deserve a word I can say. Oh my god. Poor Kid Fisto, by the way, is covered in mud and he doesn't even know what he's fighting. He's just wildly swinging, hoping something in the air is getting hit. <laughs> That's all he's doing. Oh god. This is a mud this is a mud battle right here. I cannot believe how much damage this stupid mud slap is doing. I'm gonna have to use another potion. He's gotta be running low though. Come on, Kid Fisto. Please hit with one of your moves. Let me see. I think he can take a crit. Mm. I think he can take a crit. Shit! Oh, thank god. He can't take a crit from there, so... Okay, back to healed up. Not bad, tackle. You know what's funny is that I'm almost positive I had this exact same scenario when I played this with the Mew Mew Force. <laughs> Except for, I remember him readily beating my ass pretty bad. Okay. Thank God for low special attacks on Pidgeotto. Can Kid Fisto, please? I need you to hit. Hit. Come on. This is literally gonna turn into Pidgeotto just having to die from struggle because I literally can't hit this man <laughs> with the broad side of a door. Thank you, Kid Fisto. Now here's the thing, do I switch into mouse? Let him take the- he's out of gusts. <laughs> Isn't that what's happening right now? Is it now you're out of gusts as well? Oh man. And he hit me with a crit too. He has to be out of gusts. That's hilarious. No, he has it. He just decided to switch up his game plan, I guess. Come on. For the- <laughs> God damn it. Oh. I don't want to use another potion on you, Kid Fisto. I need you to, I need you to hit. Come on, come on, he's right there. There we go. Okay, well, lesson learned there. Uh, <laughs> that was almost very bad. Now you learn rock throw. Son of a bitch, that's fine. You didn't need it, it turned out. Darn, my dad's cherished bird Pokemon. All right, take this. It's the official Pokemon League Zephyr Badge. Jesus Christ. Man. You know, yeah, I know, they can use Flash at any time. Let me guess, that's Mud Slap, right? Mud Slapping? Okay, I will think before I act, sir. Okay. Later, brood. Okay, now we can finally, I think I'm gonna save it up there because Jesus, oh wait, never mind. I have to talk to Professor Elm and get an egg, I think. Oh, okay. Sure, I can talk to him. Let's talk to him first and then I'll try and end the episode. Hello, nerd. Long time no see. He has another favor to ask. Would you take this? Yes, sure. I have egg. Well, that means it's a Togepi, right? Okay. Sure. Welcome egg. I don't know if I'll use it. Actually, yeah, because I got egg in um, Violet, Tens Violet City or whatever. Um, I should be fine. 
going here. Thank you for waiting. Thanks. All right. And with that, everyone, we'll end it, and we'll start the next episode actually catching someone. So if you liked it, please leave a like. And I'll see you guys in the next episode for another good old Pokemon Nuzlocke. Goodbye. Stop recording.